There is, I'm just in the animal step and there is cows, horses, pigs, sheep, chickens, and wait for it, your favorite, bees. Nice. I think they have bees, that's interesting. Um, maybe we should, like, maybe you should have, like, a side hustle when we do the... Maybe you should do the side hustle when we do, like, the the far, like the fields and everything. Maybe you should have, like, a couple of chickens we could feed or something. I don't know. <laughs> just yeah. like a, like, pet. <laughs> Did you see this guy's just checking out our trailer? He's just loving it. He's like, can I buy this thing? Mr. Jackson wants oh, to get, buy the trailer. a second buyer over here. This guy's not as interested, oh, wow. though. What are these guys this walking is like around with suits for? I mean, that's it's not like a country suits. fair, isn't it? <laughs> We should do All that, right. um, what's the saying? I can't remember now. Heary, heary, or something. <laughs> oh yeah, from like courts but, uh, or whatever. Yeah. Alright, so... Hey, JJ. What are we going to do in this video? What are the plans? The plan is... Not to play in the utter darkness. That's the plan. That's the pri primary plan, which I think we already completed. So we start uh, at 7 o'clock in the morning, which is nice. It is a good and start I think time. we should... That's a good start time. I think we should prepare these fields uh, for something that we actually want to grow. Because we kind of inherited or bought these fields with some crops on them already. So maybe yep. we should join them like we planned last time and plant them with something we want. I think that's a good idea. Yeah, we could plow right over this whole road. Um, I know the plowing picks up little rocks. I don't know if we have to do anything with these, though. Huh. Um, we, yeah, we could plow this whole also, field and that whole field and just this whole area in between. But I think we need to rent some plows because these are cultivators, and that's something different, apparently. Found that out in the last episode. Oh, wow. So should we uh, go rent some plows? Um, you are 100% certain these don't work now? Um, not 100%, but um, if you look at the plow in the store, it says it can be used to create new land. And I don't think go we ahead. can use those ones too. Okay, um, are we discarding the grass or are we collecting it? What do you think? Um, I think we should collect it. But so we, maybe we should get like the tether or tether, whatever it's called. Yeah, should we rent that or buy that? Because I think let's I rent bought... that and maybe yeah, for science, maybe we should rent the tether thing and see how much dried grass gives us. Well, I, we bought the mower and then we have the uh, the baler over here, which we rented. So if we just rent or buy the the tether or teeter, however you say it, we should be able to bail mm -hmm. all of this up, dry it and bail it, and then probably get more money for it. I would assume. Maybe we should actually buy it. I think we should buy it, JJ. Let's I start so investing in our future. I think so too. I mean, we we rented it the first time, but I think because we have our own grass that we can cut around here, we could just keep doing that for money whenever it grows. So I think this would actually be something that could be useful and. If we have contracts, we could do those as well with it. Yeah, let's go with it. Let's go with it. I'm down. So are we going to head to the store or should we just buy it from here? I, I guess we think have, we still to need go to back. go to the store to pick it up, right? Yeah. Mine is yellow. Is, is mine yellow? I think mine is yellow, isn't it? Or yours yeah. is yellow? Yeah, yours is yellow. So let's go, because um, one of us can bring back the plow, and the other one can bring back the te tether, tether, tether. Uh, also, I JJ. This again? I forgot all my controls. Also, JJ, <clears throat> check out through the right-hand side of your cab. You can see the guy actually pressing the accelerator pedal when you accelerate. That's a neat detail. They didn't have oh. to do that. 
that is, but where are my legs? No, just kidding. <laughs> Oi! Uh, yeah, I'm following you to the store because uh, guess what? I forgot how to get there again. Well, the store is pretty easy. Through the field. Yeah, just basically straight. To, it's basically straight in front of us, and then a little bit to the left. Or actually, no, a little bit to the right. This guy is he's properly farming. You saw that those sunflower seeds or sunflowers. Is this corn or what is it? Look, look, yeah, or looks like is corn. that cane? That's sugar cane, isn't it? Well, maybe, maybe it's corn. uh, I think it's corn. Also, JJ, I think in this episode we should buy some animals. Yeah, we could do that. What, maybe what even the, like pigs. I was gonna say, what is like the easiest animal to to take care of? Do you think? Probably bees or chicken, but I think pigs, they need their manure cleared, but I think then you can use the manure to fertilize the fields, something like that. Man, I totally oh, forgot all of okay. these controls. Are you playing on the keyboard? No, I'm, I'm using the controller, but I just forgot everything. How do you bring up the map right away? What, what button was that again? Uh, map is press the L B and then toggle with the left uh, left stick, pushing the left thumb stick. So hold oh, okay. down the L, L B and pushing the left thumb stick. Yeah, so it's just up in front of us here on the left. I thought you were going to ram me over the road. <laughs> I probably would have. How do you, how do you honk again? Uh, so, push in the right bumper and press A. Ah. I'm kind of using like a mix of keyboard and controller, so some of the controls are a little weird. Alright. Alright, um, you so, okay to buy the cultivator, and I'll I'll buy the tether thing. Um, <clears throat> so this time my bucket isn't here again, but this time I don't have access to the menu. It's ah. just not here at all. Let's check out what happened. I can probably just buy it from the menu. Um. When you just like pause the game or whatever. Uh, you are still a farm manager. What if I dismiss you as a farm manager and then promote you to the farm manager? Okay, I will sort of re-promoted you. See if that fixes anything. <clears throat> yeah, there's nothing, nothing here, but it's fine. I can just pause it and buy it instead of. I mean, it's basically the same thing. Oh yeah. It is the same thing. Um, I actually did not know that. So, you want to buy the teeter and I'll buy the plow, or... Or uh, rent, uh, I'll rent the plow. Yes. Yes, I'll buy the teeter. Now, let's... Um, you want to buy the plow? I think let's invest in uh, some equipment, yeah. Let's buy it. Come on, teeter, where are you? Oh no. Or Mansu. Or is there? Is it grape technology? It is grape and olive technology. Wow. That's hmm. interesting. <clears throat> Heather, right, I spent 16,000 on Heather. the plow. I spent 7,000 on the tether. Tether? Tether? Oh wow, what's this? Um... So... I'm checking our balance and it says we don't have any loan to the bank that you were talking about. 
so we really? are millionaires yeah so this money is ours that's what it says if you just push the start the start button and go to the yep. dollar sign under the tractor bottom right corner it has a loan or you know total <laughs> balance and then loan our loan is zero oh you're so right we, and there's no loan and, interest as well that's a zero yeah and it, it says to repay it but there's no but you can't click to repay we can borrow but we can't repay so we we have a million dollars so we're absolutely buying everything then we're, oh sorry yeah, to misinform you i was sure i'm sure i read somewhere that we actually borrowed that but oh my god that plow is huge <laughs> good luck good luck with that hopefully we can attach and pull this thing it's a lot bigger than i was expecting Oh, your attire is absolutely beautiful. Oh my god. Oh no, you need some weights <laughs> on the front. <laughs> you need some uh, weights on the front, JJ. It might fall a little bit deeper. Into car. I don't know if you saw that. <laughs> almost crashed I got, into like I a got infinite civilian. wheelies. Okay, Quick, let's see. get some weight before they report you to the police. Yeah, I'm looking in the, the menu here. Where exactly are these weights at? Oh, here we go. Weights. Maybe, um, um, or maybe buy a bigger tractor, JJ, if you want, because we're like millionaires. That might not be a bad idea. We could maybe use this one for smaller stuff. We could use, we could keep one of the smaller tractors, like the yellow one, the one I'm driving. Let's keep it. Or like stuff like this, tether and the bailing and stuff like that. But sell, I think sell your tractor and just buy a bigger one. Because the equipment is getting bigger, but our tractors aren't, so... There's only so much weight you can put to the front, right? Okay, yeah. Um, I think you should sell your your little retractor and... So how exactly do I do that? Well, that's... I went to the, the vehicle overview and... <clears throat> I can see which one's mine, but I can't exactly... I did hear that if you drive them to the shop, you actually get more money than if you just sell them through the menu, so... I guess maybe there must be a place around here to sell them. Maybe that's what this is. I think you might be onto something here. Oh no, that that's a repair. Well, you actually get more money for repairing them as well. Because the cost it takes you to repair them, you usually get more than that back. Although I can't access this menu either for some where reason. Did you, where did you um? Where did you read the information that? You can actually get more money for selling uh, it. It was in like a uh, just a farming 22 tips video that I watched. Oh, okay. And they said, yeah, if you bring your vehicles to the shop, you actually get more money for selling them. I think it's like 10% more or something like that. They said. I wonder where you need to like drive in to sell it. Hmm. I'm not sure. I'm going to look in this help menu here. I'm going to jump in your tractor to see whether... Whether... Sure. Um, I can discover something. I mean, we can sell them from the own, own the items um, submenu. <clears throat> uh, I'm not sure how much it... That might be what we have to do. I'm trying to see if there's something in here about selling them at the store, but I don't really see so, anything. So your tractor, we can get 36000 for your tractor. Well, I think we'll just sell it that way. We can try and find it you know, after this video, if someone in the comments can help us out, or we can just look it up and try and figure out where to go. Yeah, but, absolutely. Yeah, apparently you get more money if you bring it here, but yeah. But it's we'll not just... a huge loss, JJ. We ba we bought it for 49 and we're selling it for 36 so that's not a huge loss. We yeah. used it quite a bit now. And it, Unless it's you cheapest... sell it, because it's your, it's, your, it's your baby, so you say fa farewell to it, you say goodbye to it. And which, which menu did you say that was in? Owned Vehicles? <laughs> Uh, yeah, if you press the um, select button, you know, the uh, the other, the menu button on the left. Um, oh, okay. There's an owned item, just 
sell the one with more hours because that's yours, right? <laughs> that's weird. Mine is worth more than yours? Yeah, maybe color is more desirable. <laughs> true, true. Yeah, it did cost $1,500 for that color, so... All right, it has been sold. I'm, I'm kind of excited. I'm not gonna watch any in any like sub menus. Uh, I'm not gonna watch in. I'm not gonna sit in the shop menu. I'm gonna let you select the track there without me telling. Uh, without telling me, basically surprise me with your selection. I have absolutely no idea what would be a good tractor to get, but uh, that's part of the fun, I guess. I'm just kind of looking at the prices. It looks like we got. 97,000 is the cheapest one in the medium tractors. I think you oh, want to go for big boys, don't you? Oh, you want me to grab a big big one? I think so, because what if you buy a medium tractor and you still need to invest in some weights? I don't know. Maybe even, even well, says what kind of weight you can take. These big tractors... Oh my god, some of them are huge. <laughs> Uh, I haven't looked this far yet, but some of these big tractors, they cost uh, about a half a million dollars. Oh, maybe not that one then. <laughs> <laughs> maybe not that one, JJ. Something else. This one is... Something in, in between. 506,000, I think, is the most expensive tractor here. Wow. So but, that million um, is not all that much of money, is it? It's not well, that the, much. The, the medium ones are like 100 to about 240, I think it was. And then these ones are about 247 up to 506,000, I think it was. Like up to 300 grand, I think it's something something that we would like to invest into a tractor. Up to 300 grand, maybe just a little bit over, but not, not too much over that 300. Much more, Ideally, we want to do maybe some a bit of animals on the side, and that's going to cost a little bit to build the building as well. Yeah. <clears throat> Actually, I'm going to look up what's... Oh, okay. So it's kind of like um, the prices go from like 280 to about 350 There's kind of a big jump. Because you got 280 247 279 285 289 292 so all kind of in that 280 range, and then it jumps up to, well, I guess there's a 312, but it jumps to like 341, or 343, 351, 355, um, and then, yeah, oh, 329, 346. But there's kind of like a, a twenty thirty thousand dollar $30,000 gap. But I'm just kind of like We're basically going to need, I mean, 350, so 350 is reasonable. I would agree with 350. How about 351? Perfect. It looks like it has an attachment on the front, which I know is a, a big deal. So we can do that. Go for it. We need a hundred grand for chickens, like minimum. And if you want to go pigs, maybe we need two hundred grand. So sort of just um, wow. yeah. Actually, whatever. Like fill your boots, buy whatever you like, JJ. You're worth it. I was just looking at you can get another a bigger engine in this thing, and it's like a hundred and one horsepower more, but it adds fifty thousand dollars to the price. Wow, that's huge. So far, I haven't seen that we need more powerful engines. We even the electric electric ones kind of coped. <laughs> yeah, I think. Uh, we should be fine with all of this. Let's just... Oh, wait. <laughs> I, I may have accidentally equipped a bigger engine on accident. I thought I oh took it off. Oh my god, what is that <laughs> monstrosity? <laughs> Where's the wheels? There are no wheels. John Deere. That's a monster, and it sounds great as well. Yeah, it's weird having the electric ones, and then all of a sudden you get this. It's got a big engine sound. Can that not have conventional wheels? Because it looks like it can. No, it only had tracks on this one. Really? Yeah. Whoa. Oh my god, JJ, that's a monster. 
It looks good though. You think so? Yes. Okay, I'm gonna look ridiculous with my new tractor now. Let's go. I wonder what the top speed is. Oh, 42, holy crap, this thing can fly too. Just don't kill any civilians. Yeah, right. So we gotta go down the Also, the tracks are like, tracks look like... I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna, okay. I'm gonna cut, cut through. I was gonna say we can go down this road and take a right, but I, I actually came through here earlier. There's a little road back here. Ah, you know all the shortcuts. You might be able to see it on the map a little bit, but... That tractor looks ridiculous, JJ. <laughs> OTT or what? I love my, uh, my new outfit, too. Looking like a real cowboy. A rancher. Now you need some horses, that's for sure. <laughs> I can see you, like, booting it through the field. <laughs> Yeah, this thing actually goes surprisingly fast. It says it can go 42. Maybe like sub 40s is like speed of most tractors, right? Like the trucks usually go about 60, 70 miles an hour. So maybe that's the sort of sort of uniform speed for all of the tractors. Obviously. Yeah, must be. Oh, we have 666,000. Nice. The 666 is like the, the number for the devil, if you didn't know. So while we have a bit of driving time, what kind of animals do you would like to go for? Well, I was wondering, because what, what do you think would be the easiest to take care of? Because this is just my, my thought. If we have all this grass, we could feed cows with that, or sheep, right? But chickens wouldn't eat that. No, um, so yeah, that's a, that's a really good idea, and I think... Because instead cows, of having to buy uh, cows, the food... We could just use our own grass if we have it. Yeah, maybe sheep, but sheep need sheep need cutting, don't they? Like shearing or whatever it's called. And cows need milk. Oh, that is interesting. I'm just watching you work with that thing. That's so weird. It's <laughs> spreading the grass, right? Yeah, that was not what I thought, but I guess that works. I thought it's gonna instant instantly turn into like the the dried grass, but maybe it's drying now. <laughs> maybe it takes a while. On my screen, you just ran over some crows. <laughs> Did I? <laughs> Animal cruelty reported. Yeah, the teeter just whipped them all around. I mean, it didn't actually move, but it it was just funny. So JJ, what does it say when you point your sort of cursor on the uh, on the grass? Does it say drying? It, it does not say any. Oh no, it, it did for a second there. Oh, that was the field. Okay. Um, yeah, it doesn't say anything. So I, I'm assuming maybe we just have to leave it here until it turns yellow. I think so. I thought we can just pick it up straight away, but I don't think that we can do that. So. Like yourself, I thought it's straight away it's gonna turn into like a yellowy stuff and we can pick it up immediately. It does look like it is oh. drier because it's not as dark, but. Oh my god, your tractor is a monster. Alright. Monster truck. Confirm. Season 11. You're gonna make a you're gonna make a quick work out of that field with that thing. That plow is massive, by the way. You still there, JJ? Yeah, I'm just. I don't know why, because in, in the last one my controls were in the top left, but this one they're not up there. I don't know if I changed something on accident. Last time you got out of the tractor and you got back in, and it was kind of. Fixed. <laughs> it's like I don't know how to lower this thing. I thought it was like LB and that showed up all the controls and then. Yes, exactly. Because my controls aren't showing up, so 
Can I get into the tractor? Because remember last time that fixed fixed it. Yeah, you can hop in. Um, I'm just guessing. So you can switch this thing oh, no, from it's right. Oh no, something's happening. Yeah, you can switch it from the left side to the right if you click LB and X. But I don't know what the other controls are. Like I don't know how to drop it down. Oh my god, the inside of this tractor looks insane. Try now. Yeah, it doesn't say anything. Um, I guess I'll just have to push oh, you, the button. Oh, uh, you just you lowered it. Yeah, that worked. I don't know if I'm far and enough also, over. And also, are you holding? Are you holding down LB? I was. Yeah, nothing's showing up. I, I think my game's a little bit like bugged or something. I'm not exactly sure. Also, can you not turn it like wider so you take more of the ground? Um, uh, can you like, not adjust the plow? No, it, it, this is all it, it does, because I'll show you. I'll flip it the other way, mm -hmm. and all it does is, is the same thing on the opposite side. Ah, okay, gotcha. So, like, if you were to, you know, turn around in the field or whatever, you can switch it. But yeah, that's, that's as far as it controls. goes. So I'm thinking maybe your control sometimes doesn't show up because you sort of play sort of a hybrid way, like half um, could be, yeah, half keyboard, half. half I don't know. Yeah, you you might be right. Uh, we can maybe rejoin? I don't know. What's, what's your thoughts or your kid um, carrying like this? How do you hire or not hire the uh, worker again? I accidentally hired somebody because I was just pushing buttons. Uh, how to unhire? I'm not sure. Is it LB and B or something like that? It says, well, how do you hire them? How do you hire a worker? Oh, so you press, um, you press just B. Literally just B. Oh, there we go. So yeah, AI worker has stopped. Maybe you switched off that sort of top left sub menu because you all the controls are there but you cannot see them. Like maybe somehow. Yeah, yeah that F, is. Uh, maybe uh, maybe an F F1 or something. It is F1. F1. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. I must have somehow uh, taken that off. Okay. Uh, Sorted. it. Oh, allow create fields. There's a button to create fields with this plow. Ooh. That sounds exciting. Um, lower. There we go. Pretty bad at driving this thing, though, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> it's weird because the plow is at an angle behind you. Yeah. Uh, so don't forget you can zoom out as well. Yeah, so it's... I don't know, it's not exactly straight. It's Oh my gosh, there's a deer that just ran through our field. <laughs> deer simulator 2022. <laughs> Have you seen one of those yet? The deer? You still haven't nope. seen one, right? Oh my gosh. You yet to see one. You yet to see one I haven't. Crazy. They're populating your screen. Because we can like cut down these trees and stuff and make our, our property go back here, can't we? Ooh, maybe we should cut some trees. That's not a bad idea. I think we could do that to expand our our property a little bit more. Yeah, somebody said... Somebody said uh, logging is quite fun in this game. Right, okay. Is it, wasn't it Liam or someone? Someone said in the comments. I don't remember. It looks like you're picking up that grass just fine, but they're, they're kind of a different color than before, right? If maybe it's been tethered now, maybe even in bales it will dry? Mm, I don't know. It is I different color, either. you're right, it's more lighter, but can it go even more light? Um, how's plowing going? It's pretty good, but yeah, I'm not very good at it. <laughs> now it looks like you half of the field is, well, actually not half, but like third of the field is done. 
I think you're doing just fine. So th th it looks like it's a lot of grass here, but I don't think it's as dense because I'm driving back and forth and we have two bales, three bales. So I think it's not as dense grass. Okay, there's some at the top of our field as well. Yeah, but I'm driving over it and the percentage barely goes up. I'm literally driving over the, the stuff, so maybe it's made like that so you can't harvest random stuff. Could be, yeah. Uh, I just mean uh, you got to teeter the stuff at the top of our field. And actually there's still more up there that you got to cut because I didn't cut all of it in the end of the last one. Gotcha. It looks kind of weird we have all these machines now. Like we got two cultivators, we got the the mower, the... What is it? The it's header like we for need the a car park, right? Yeah. Or the machine oh. park. Well, wait, is this... Cause one of, is one of these houses our farmhouse? Because remember people said you could uh, skip time with that? Is one of these houses considered our farmhouse? Well, we bought a land, so you kind of would hope so. Or else maybe we have to... I'm gonna check it out, JJ. Have to uh, put one on there. Did you go working hard? <clears throat> right, so farmland. Yeah, so all of the houses are ours. And even beyond into the forest, you know, there's a, like a little path. Even that's ours. Okay, nice. Remember where you sort of ran in last time to chase after the deer? Right yeah. That's ours as well, apparently. That's cool. So I would like an explanation why all these people... Like there's so many trees, we could definitely do harvest. Uh, no harvesting but the uh, logging yeah I think we could cut and down those trees and expand our land and make our fields bigger if we wanted to and I would also like an explanation why are these people walking through our land now that I've figured that it's our land apparently they think it's public property huh. I have no idea maybe the path is public property and everything around us it's ours because it's like highlighted it's our family hmm. that is really interesting i can't see any any skip symbols or anything like that yeah i'm wondering if these houses are just kind of like basic houses and for us to actually get a like the farmhouse we have to buy it i'm guessing I can hear you like tractor from miles away where the electric one was really quiet. <laughs> this one is like yeah, I think we we probably got to watch the fuel gauge on this one a lot more. Thirsty. Well, just because those electric ones seem to last forever. Um. Oh, oh, oh. So we can buy a farmhouse for twenty thousand, JJ, if you down. I don't know. Well, I think we only it's a, need a it's just a basic one. I think we only need a farmhouse if we plan on skipping time. Are we planning on skipping time or no? Uh, well, we can play at night. I don't mind. Well, because well, what I was thinking is maybe maybe we could just pause the time because I think we can probably do like two or three episodes in each season or day or whatever. Because mm -hmm. the first episode. It took us like half a day and then we wasted like half a day and then we did another one through through the entire night so it's probably like three episodes per day probably would be my guess you know right, roughly okay. if you were to so we could maybe pause the time and then play like three episodes and then go forward a day or whatever and then kind of just unpause and pause it as we need so we don't like need to skip time i don't know if that would work or not but it was just kind of the way i was thinking of doing it no sounds like a good idea Absolutely. Sounds like a good idea. 
sounds like a good money saving um, <coughs> money saving tip um, what else we might need is the garage but we don't have enough space here for the garage you know for the for all the tools store some yeah store some vehicles or something yeah. in the shed yeah but they're massive buildings and we don't have that kind of space on this on these two plots yeah so maybe like you said maybe we'll have to chop down some trees and make room wow you're almost done JD, kind of it, it's not very straight at all like I said, it's, it's really weird having this this thing on like half my truck. Like basically from the middle of my truck to the left it plows and the other half is just kind of like not there at all. It's very weird. You want to try it? Um, yeah. I was going to say the answer is yes, whether you said no or not. <laughs> Uh, JJ, yeah. there's a very simple and easy way to do logging. There's you can buy a chainsaw for 1,000 and do it manually. Oh, nice. We gotta try that out, don't you think? Yeah. Absolutely. Two chainsaws, two two wild guys with the chainsaws, like a new new thumbnail. <laughs> okay. That okay. Must... So, don't forget to take like screenshots for thumbnails. Um. If you want. That's a good point. Uh, fold plow. Oh. Um, did you know that there is a a sale um, area in this as well? Uh, what, like oh. discontinued? Oh, sorry, discounted like things? Yeah. I didn't. What's on um, sale? Um, right now there is a medium tractor. It's 40% off. It's 178000 Ooh. A John Deere 8R series. This is John Deere, isn't it? Yeah. When it says R8 series, it already sort of um, resembled 605R for some reason. <laughs> oh, this yeah, is... This is oh, this huge. tractor is awesome. It's huge. <laughs> I'm just used like to looking nice at... Drive as well. Looking at our little ones, they like go up to where you're sitting, the top of them. <laughs> and have you um, checked the interior out as well? Interior of this truck or no? Or oh, this um, tractor? I, I actually it? haven't, no. It's like insane, it has two two screens, like LCD screens and stuff. Oh, wow. It's like a rocket ship. So where are those chainsaws you're talking about? Um, so if you go into, again, press the, press the left, uh, the, the left menu button, yep. then go into like the, the box, the cardboard box icon, and there you can select wood. There's a, like, there's basically categories of farming and there's one for wood oh, and okay. under there you'll see like the equipment you can buy for wood. I don't know if I explained it well. Yeah. Yeah. I got it. You can use a chainsaw to cut down trees. Hosquarva? It, Quarna? Hosquarna, yeah, yeah, that's the one. Hosquarna. It's like a famous European chainsaw, by the way. Oh, okay, yeah, I've never heard of it, but it's probably they a... even do. Go ahead. They even do uh, dirt bikes. Uh, I know it's oh. like a random... That's <laughs> random, uh Yeah, it seems like a totally weird field for them to be in, but, you know, whatever. Maybe it's in miscellaneous. Yeah, I don't know where the where the chainsaw oh, you haven't would found be. It? No, I found Hold it on, on that screen, but like where it would be on the tool so you screen. Went to, you went to the wood, yeah. Yeah. Oh, here so I did find it. Wood and, it's un yeah, under the, all the way the to tools. the right. If you scroll it. Yeah, I, I was looking for it like in the actual uh, like tool screen, you know, where they have like balers and tethers and animals and stuff they have they have a certain section for chainsaws there's actually four different chainsaws i wonder if they're any different whoop you already own this item what uh because i bought one oh i was gonna say what but then you can buy it again right 
Oh no. Yeah, I can buy that it again. Be, I was going to say that would be disappointing if you're going to have. Well, there's chainsaws. there's there's four different kinds, so I'll I'll get a different one. Yeah, I've got the Hus Husqvarna one. I got a McCulloch. Is that, if that's how you say Ooh, it. Oh, McCulloch. Know. I don't know what that is, but it sounds exciting. McCulloch. They all cost a thousand, right? I think. Um, yeah, I'm gonna turn off the baler because it's making noise. Or is that your tractor? Oh, weird. What's happening? It was the tractor was making noise, but you weren't in it. But then when I hopped in, it was still going. Um. Right, which tree is gonna be your first victim, JJ? That's the question. Well, how do you have your chainsaw out? Uh, yes. Oh, switch to hand tool. Nice. Oh, you even got your like. You even got your like. Your suit. Yeah, you got gear on. You got one too. Um, I don't know. What do you? Th Let's. I'm gonna check the map again quick. How far do we own? Yeah. So go into where your wardrobe was. Next to that, there's a farmland icon, and it will show you how much of it you own. <clears throat> Hopefully, explained it correctly. So it's a pretty big area, then, right? I thought so. I mean, we could turn that whole back area into field if we wanted, like the place all behind where, our house. The, the place where people like to go for strolls. Yeah, I'm done. <laughs> it should be even on our property. How oh, dare Because we own a lot of land over here, but yeah, there's. I mean, not we paid the... for this. Our hard-earned money. We paid for this. We can do whatever we like with it, right? All right, let's see if we can chop this one down. Activate hand tool. It did not allow me to cut that one. What is going on? Let's try something different then. No, not that one either. No, I'm, I'm getting a lot of lag, like I'm not really moving. There we go. Oh, there it went. Oh, oh it, just, it just chopped off one of the limbs. What are you doing, JJ? Chopping up this tree, I guess. Are you getting it? I think so. If, oh, you have you, to like... If you point it at the tree, it'll like light up green when you can cut. Right, but you can't cut everything, so American Elm is not allowed. Ah, okay. Oh my gosh, that is a big cut. So not everything can be cut. Gotcha. Huh. Oh, wow. Um, I think you can somehow turn it sideways. Oh, rotate. There we go. Look at this. What's uh, up, how do I... You can rotate your saw and then cut it. Here we go. There goes the tree. Bimbop! So if you hold oh, LB wow, and dude. then you push push the right uh, right thumbstick, left or right, you can rotate your saw back and rotate, forth. Yeah. And then you can start chopping you them can down. Have a nice cut. You can have like a nice cut. I wonder how we get these little stumps out of here though, once we get them into... Oh, there's a stump remover. Oh, really? For the tractor. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. See, it looks like some trees we won't be able to cut, though. This one doesn't allow us to cut, I don't think. Oh, oh no, it's too far away. I think away. it does. It just needs to be in a certain angle, yeah. Yeah, or if you're just too far away, it, it just lights up blue. Wow. This is oh, interesting. Oh, electricity pole. I don't want to cut that. 
cut the power to our house. Maybe not. And do we have to chop it up? Well, uh, well, do we have to chop like once it's on the ground? Looks like it as well. Oh wow! I think in order to load it, you do you have to chop it into chunks, is what I understand. Some of these little branches are really annoying in the way. Annoying, right? Because you can't really you see where you're, where you're cutting. We don't. We hate nature, basically, Jay-Z. <laughs> these trees, <laughs> these trees take like years to grow, and we're just like going crazy with them. Just chopping them all down. If Greta Thunberg is gonna watch our video, she's gonna be crying. Poor Greta. You know what Greta Thunberg is? Yeah. I said it that I wasn't sure whether that's a European thing. Yeah, no, I'm pretty sure she's she's worldwide famous. Or infamous, whatever. <laughs> I'll go with the infamous, I think. It's kind of cool that this leaves it like exactly how you cut it, basically. Yeah, it doesn't disappear or it turns into some sort of uh, fabricated log already. Yeah, like I cut ah. most of the limbs off of this one. Is that what they call limbs? I thought they called branches. Yeah, branches. Nice. More daylight in our farmhouse. Yeah. Pesky tree is not obstructing. It's funny because every time I chop down a tree, all of a sudden it just gets brighter. That's what, that's what I mean. Trees are evil. Okay, so how do we object too heavy? Oh, so we need to chop it into the small. Got chop it into smaller chunks, huh? And check it out. Oh, nice. You pick Got one it, up. JJ. Yep. Boom. Trailer is loaded. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, oh. I managed to pick that up. That's crazy. That's hilarious. Alright. Oh, now I see what you mean with the object too heavy. It popped up. Pick up object. <clears throat> oh no, it looked the massive. It looked like you're carrying the whole tree. <laughs> Yeah, that's put it funny. I'm gonna try and hop up onto the trailer and bring it with me. If I can get it. it keeps falling out of my hands. It's quite difficult to place it, yeah. I think I'll just try and throw it like we did before, maybe. Hmm. I'm going to make a little ladder. Let's see if this works. Almost. Alex that looks absolutely crazy. <laughs> <laughs> it almost like works. 
Looks like you're trying to steal the whole forest. I don't know how you got yours in there. It, it was a struggle. I'll, I'll tell you that much. It was a struggle. Oh, here we go. Look at me, big strong man. Big strong American man. There we go. We got a whole tree in there. <laughs> and it would be hilarious if that actually stayed like that. When Once you started to move and drive. Right. wonder if you can sell it like this. I Tongs. think you can. I'm not positive, but I think so. <clears throat> yeah, if you pick up another one, you'll have to try and walk up the ladder. Or, uh, walk up the ladder. Walk up your truck. The hood. Yeah, just turn around and walk backwards and you'll just climb right up. You can try it with that bale you got there. Um... Yeah, because it kind of like inter interacts with a tractor and falls off. Otherwise. Oh yeah, you got to look up. <clears throat> ah. Try it, try it again. Look up because your 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 hay, your hay bale will uh will hit it and then fall. If you yeah, look up. Yeah. There you go. Now just turn around and it. drop it. Yep. Slam dunk. Slam Bum. dunk. <laughs> it's a little bit easier. You're gonna try to get that in. Yeah, that's how I got the last one in. See? Logging with JJ. I kind of missed it, but we're basically in. There we go. <clears throat> this looks so funny. We got a bunch of, like, grass or hay bales, and then we got all kinds of trees hanging out. I'm going to try and move the trailer, see what happens. Do they clip through the trailer or actually stay in there? Yeah, that's a good, good question. Because I, I know... Oh, they're staying in. On my screen. Oh, They're wow. all staying in. Oh my it's god, like you got camouflage. like... You got like a whole tree in there. It's so hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Actually, you could probably leave your truck like that. We could probably run right up it and throw it in that way too. Um. Also, JJ, are we not like losing track of the objective? Are we not connecting these fields? <laughs> Oh, I mean, what do you think? we're working on we're working on making a third field. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, I'm done. No, I don't know. Yeah, let's. Um, I mean, we we tried oh, it out. We could we could work on it later, right? Yeah, yeah. I just was curious how the sort of mechanics of the tree cutting works. I guess it's exciting that we actually have or had a million dollars. That was pretty cool. It was exciting. Oh, you pulled one out. Unlucky. <laughs> Never lucky, JJ. There you go. Boom. Fully camouflaged tractor. Um, so you said you kind of found a way how to connect the fields. Can can you give it a go? I'll just sort of uh, observe. Yeah. So if you if you hop in my tractor, I'll, I'll tell you what to do. There's a button, mm -hmm. and you push. It says it's like LB, and then allow create fields. Or something like that right yes and then you can just drive over it and it'll create a field right where you are there you oh, go it does you, you extended the field already oh wow well, so, so yeah. you can actually cut turn all of this well not where the trees are but well that's the thing if we cut down the trees we might be able to expand it so that's the the hope, I guess. What's um? What's your thinking? What should we do with this? I don't know. What would Did be a good say crop? we wanted to do like? Is it? I think you said. Is it poplar last time? I can't remember. Would we agree? Yep. What are we gonna I don't do think next? we. I don't think we really agreed on anything because poplar is trees, and we both thought like maybe it's not going to be right. Like, you know, it's harvestable year round, but maybe it's not going to be ready in like. A month or whatever it would be. Ah, uh, uh, yes, 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 yes. So now it's coming back to me. Um, let's look back at this. Oh, that's not it. I forgot where the. Oh, here. Um. Yeah, we could do oilseed radish or grass or poplar. Those kind of go year round. But. I don't want to do something that's like too confusing, but I guess I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm just overthinking it. 
Because like I think grass, they're all pretty much the same. Yeah, grass we've already done. Poplar we don't know if it needs a long time to grow or something, but we have planting season with oil seed radish this month that we're on, so today and then tomorrow, October. And then you can harvest it all year round. So we could plant it and then when it's ready we could harvest it. Yeah, because my thinking was maybe we should plant something and then we can mess around with trees or animals in between like while it grows. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'm down with that. This just sounds pretty simple. Yeah, I think we could go with that. And neither one of us really know what we're doing, but, uh, you know, we can... I saw on your video, you can, like, click into the different menus and see exactly what you need to do certain things. Yes. So that could be very helpful. We could figure out exactly what we need to do that. But you, you have that menu as well, right? Yeah, I have it, but I didn't know it was there, is what I'm saying before. Oh, okay. So now, yeah, so that is, that's very helpful. Or we, we can even do two things, JJ. We can not connect these fields for now and just do two different things and see co how they compare price-wise and how easy, that, how quick to grow. That's true. I mean, we, we did create more field already, so... And I'm just 50% done on this other field with your tractor, because oh, okay. I borrowed this. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. I'm borrowing yours as a, a s stool to step up onto. Oh, that's what my tractor means to you. That's mean. <laughs> it's a stool. I just, I walk all over it. <laughs> One of these days, these boots are gonna... Something on it. <laughs> Can't remember yeah. how the song goes. Walk all over you. That's the one. I expect you to clean the hood after you dirty it with your dirty farm boots. My farm boots are completely clean. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, I just got a fresh outfit. These boots are brand new. Brand spanky new. You might be still like eligible for return if you don't wear them too much. Well, that's why I got to step on your tractor. I'd rather step on that than the ground. The ground's kind of dirty. And the dirt, yeah. 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 So, so there's, there's you, then there's animals, and then there's dirt, and then there's my tractor at the very bottom of the <laughs> importance level. Yeah. Yeah, JJ, this field is ready. Looks gorgeous, oh. actually, if you ask me. So, do you know that if you, um, like, when you're out of your tractor, if you push up, you know, it goes to the hand tool. If you push up mm -hmm. again, it goes to my chainsaw. Like, I can switch to yours or mine. Or we can toggle between, so they're basically co-owned. Yeah. So we can both use either one, which is nice. interesting. It is interesting. It's weird, part of this grass is already growing back over here. Alright, okay, so the fields are ready to do whatever we do with them next. Coming in hot. <laughs> um, so what next? Cultivating? Or... Okay, where is... Or... So that oilseed radish doesn't show up on the, the packs of stuff you can buy? Mm hmm What do you think we should do? Should we do grain, grapes, olives, potatoes, sugar beets, sugar cane? I think cane, potatoes, potatoes. Potatoes and maybe beetroot or sugar beet, whatever that was. Okay, so potatoes we need. What is this? Does it say what the machine is when you click on it? Uh, nobody when you like sort of yeah so if you go on potatoes it shows you the tractor and the attachments you should get yeah so we need some <clears throat> seeds uh it has a yeah weight. so seeds is just a generic pallet and then when you go into the uh when you drive up to that with the tractor or the seed there then you select what kind of seeds you want what kind of uh, plant what what kind of seeds you're gonna plant okay so there's three three separate machines that we need it looks like for this I think this... Oh, a cultivator? 
we have already two cultivators. Yep, it says we need a cultivator, the harvester digs the potatoes out of the ground, and um, must be some kind of a planter. It says this machine is used to plant potatoes. Here we go. <coughs> Excuse me. So let's... So right, a harvester... Maybe buy, it. maybe buy it, actually. A harvester and a planter. Um... So shall we cultivate the fields first, or...? Sure. Yeah, let's do that. Why not? Oh, do you think that, that little cultivator will attach to this thing? <laughs> oh, of course. You think so? Absolutely. I didn't know if it's, like, too small for it. Probably too small, for, but these fields are not massive, so I think we can kind of live with it. Oh, nice parking, JJ. Thank you. There we go. I'm gonna get out of your way. I don't wanna get smushed by your giant tracks. Alright, so... Which do you wanna do? I'll grab this one on the left. Or we can, like, we can do one, both of us, and then we'll switch on yeah, to we the can, next one if you want. Yeah, yeah, we can start on one side and then do the other. Lower the cultivator. Cultivating. Missed a bit. Yeah, I forget that, like, when I want to move the cultivator to the right, you got to turn left or whatever, like, it's kind of opposite, you know? Oh. Very odd controls, if I must say so myself. He made a, quite a oh, weird turn up here. Whoever said farming's hard, they got it completely wrong. Could you desire how this is easy? Is your, was your stuff that your tractor doesn't turn? No, it turns. I'm just, you have a weird spot up there. Oh, sorry. Well, you know that, that top little corner where you kind of like turned around or turned down or something yeah I don't know what exactly you did but it's that was a, farm a little weird spot we'll have to plow that and make a little bit more field so it's kind of like sort of even more presentable to the investors right is this the first time we're cultivating I think it is isn't it we haven't planted anything imagine playing like farming simulator for three episodes and still not planted anything <laughs> which is destroying <laughs> trees and stuff oh yeah and other, other farmers fields exactly i mean we did cultivate but we we did it as a contract for someone else so oh yeah we did i think i can pull through the field faster than you though you're absolutely getting on me yep that can go at what, 13 was it? Mine is like 11, I think it was. Oh, okay. It looks like my oh, top I speed... I think my top speed through, through the field is 20. But I... I've only gone like 13. Oh no, it's 20 in reverse. Okay. So yeah, it says my top speed is 15 in the field when I got wow. the plow down. Wow, JJ. I don't remember which button, but you can also use like a low gear as well and stuff like that. I can't remember which button it was one. Oh, I didn't know that. That's interesting. Mm. Oh, probably in the bottom right corner it has the gears. Yeah. Or the gear icon, anyways. Yeah, the field's looking 
really nice already. We got the the plow out and then did that. And now we got the uh, harvest or er, uh, cultivators out. Absolutely beautiful. I'm loving it. To the next one yep so i was just thinking is there any kind of like a, a fuel truck you can have on this game um like uh, so you can buy um so you can buy like um portable fuel storage they do have it whatever they call it. yeah okay but it's not like a, it's not like a truck well that would be it, helpful that just to your that would be helpful because you could uh do that instead of having to run to the fuel station every time. So how's your fuel doing? Uh, it's probably like 95, 6, 7%, something like that. It's pretty close okay, to full, so but I can I can tell it's down a little bit. I'm thirsty. I was just thinking, instead of having to run to the fuel station every time, you know, it'd be kind of nice to have a, a more local... Um, like place to place to fuel up at refuel yeah by the way by the way before you blame me I didn't alter the shape of this field it's just awkward to farm <laughs> no you're fine I had a bunch of lag there and it I was trying to follow the, the outside of the field but it it completely turned me around because you know just a couple seconds like. behind and so I was just like alright I guess I'm going this way <laughs> It's kind of funny how's to look at the tracks. Yeah, how's your cons uh, constructor simulator? That was that. Uh, like for me, it was enjoyable to watch, but I don't know if I could sit through like an hour and a half of digging a hole. <laughs> you know, it's like realism. I, I'm up for realism, but that's like a hardcore realism. Yeah, that's that's at the. Luckily, the there's like different, you can set it to where it's like less stuff to do on the job, so like you'd have to dig less, I think, and like put less, like for example, if you're making like a house, you'd have to put up like less framing and less like materials for the the walls and like everything would just be a little bit less. And there's also, also one where... like on the hardcore? No, I'm playing on normal, but there's, oh. there, there's an easier way and there's a harder way. So I'm just having it on normal, but I thought about setting it back after that one because I'm like, oh my gosh, this is taking forever. Because even that after, was... even after like, um, like luckily you could teleport your dump dump truck or tip tip truck or whatever it's called, yeah. super truck. Luckily you could do that. Otherwise it would have taken even longer. Way longer, yeah. That's crazy. It was enjoyable to watch, but if I had to dig it up, I would probably lose my shit. Yeah, I enjoyed it, but I don't know. It's at the same time, it's, it's it was a little bit too repetitive. That's for sure. That um, was the biggest. So nice detail. Hold on. Go, on. Go ahead. Uh, I was going to say interesting fact: the um, cultivator is all dirty now. I was going to say the same thing. Mine's all black, or like getting black. And then we can buy a power washer in this game as well, so <laughs> can wash that's our equipment. I mean, my tractor is a little bit dirty. Yours is still brand new. There's not a speck of dirt on yours. Yours is dirty. Or mine's already like covered. Oh wow! The of it. That must have just happened because that wasn't there before. And yours like not a speck of dirt. Showroom condition. Huh. Interesting. Okay, JJ. Oh. So let's buy a couple of cedars and a couple of pallets. Or maybe we can do it with one pallet. I don't know if you need to buy two separate pallets. Well, do I, I don't think it matters too much. I know these rocks in here, they damage our truck. Um, there's a way to put them underground or take them out, I think. I don't know if it matters too much right now. Maybe we can just do the field and figure it out later, but... Uh, yeah, I think we can disregard them for now. 
Okay, so what were you saying? Sorry, cut you off. Um, so we need um, we need two cedars, right? One for potatoes and one for beets or beetroots or. Yep. So which one are you are getting? Because I'm gonna get the other one. To make sure we don't buy the same stuff. Um, I gotta check again. What the harvester looks like for the potatoes. I'll do that one, I guess, because I was looking at that earlier. Okay, I'll do the sugar beet then. Oh yeah, but if you push the select button and you go to the like percent thing, that's where there's the sales. So right now there's mm -hmm. a sale on a cultivator and two trailers and then a tractor. John Deere. Mm -hmm. Well, the trailer is a bit of a uh, it's a bit pointless because you can literally drive every vehicle in the game, right? Unless you want to. Yeah, it just seems pointless a little bit in this game at least. Unless, like, maybe you run out of fuel and have to... Well, no, because you, you would be able to drive it up on there if you did. Right. Maybe it's, like, a faster way to move your trucks. Like, if you have a semi, you can pull a tractor up on there and then pull it around with a semi if it's a long distance. Like, you have a field in the opposite corner or something. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. So, with your blessing, I'm buying the cedar for beetroot yeah it sounds good to me so obviously it's in the shop and then i'll buy a pallet of seeds and i think we only need one pallet of seeds um because we as far as i remember from uh, simulator 2019 you, pallet is a pallet and you can select any type of seed from there to refill your truck okay or yeah i just to refill your cedar on this, it just shows like a pallet and it just says seeds. So I'm guessing, like you said, you just buy a pallet and then you can pick whatever kind of seeds you want. Yeah, I think you drive up with the cedar attachment next to the pallet and you like using a D-pad, you select whatever you want from it. Wage payment. Who's that for? JJ, you pay no, yourself I, wage. I, I saw you hiring somebody during that. I did. <laughs> oh, good. Uh, I have a chance, chance out. You can't tell anyone, or I'll do a Friday 13th. Oh, God. Oh, here we go. Potato technology. Finally found it. Oh, wow. Um, so these are the planters. They range mm -hmm. from... Wait. Used to plant, plant. Before potatoes can be harvested, the foliage needs to be cut. Okay, that's interesting. I didn't know we needed to do that either. Um, harvester. Okay, so this is the harvester, the cutter, and the planter. What, all in one? No, there's three separate machines that we need oh. to buy. Because you need to cut the top of the plants before you can dig down and get the potatoes, I guess. And that's then, right, but that's after they fully grown, right? Yeah, and then there's one to plant the seeds, and then one to pull the potatoes out of the ground. So we need three separate exactly. machines. Exactly. Exactly the same as beetroot, three machines, and in like in those type of variants. So I think the foli fo foliage one, like you, when you cut the top of the plants, I'm sure it's the same for all of the plants. But the cedar it just looks different. I've checked out potatoes and beetroots and the two different cedars. So should we buy these ones or, or rent them? I already think? bought. I I already bought the cedar, with your blessing. By oh, the okay. Way, you said it's I, okay. I heard. Yeah, I heard you say that. Uh, these ones are very expensive. Sixty the, grand. Um, the low end um, planter is forty six grand, and then the cutter is ten thousand, and then the low end um, harvester for the potatoes is two hundred and five thousand. Yeah. So we're gonna have to work on some potato fields to to get the money back, but that's fine. I mean, let's. But I think just buy the cedar at first, like now, and you know when it's well, once the once they're fully grown, we can buy what the next trailer we want or the attachment. Yeah, and the um, the more expensive one is only ten thousand more, so we might as well probably just go right to the yeah. top on that one instead of two invested. Yes, two hundred five. You can go to two fifteen. 
And it looks like they basically have the same stats and everything, except for one of them can hold a little bit more weight. I don't know what this one is. Vo volume or something? 12 meters to the third or something? I'm not exactly sure what I'm looking at with that. But anyways, um, so I'll buy this... What is this? A planter? Must be. And then you said, uh, do not buy the foliage one because you bought one, right? Uh, no, no, I haven't bought the foliage, but uh, us, uh, what I was trying to say is we could use the same one for to take the... Oh, okay, so the, you, um, you want me to buy this one then? Off. Uh, if you want, yeah, if you want to buy it now, yeah. Okay. I just don't know how long it's going to take for it to fully grow. True. Well, I already Maybe bought it just... now. <laughs> ah, fair enough. Gonna need it at some point. I guess it'll save us a trip. All right. Let's, uh... Should we head to the store? You can drive the big rig? Yeah. No, no, you do the, you do the big... I mean, yeah, okay, I'll do the big rig, but I'm also going to tow a trailer and I'm going to sell the wood to the... Sawmill. Oh, okay. Let's yeah, let's see how that works. It. Did, did you uh, see what imagine. takes what takes those trees? Yeah, sawmill. Sawmill does. Do you know where the sawmill is? Um, yes, I think. Okay, because I haven't I haven't been to the sawmill. I have no idea where that is. If on you the do, map. if you do right here, want to go this track? Oh, it's, it's a monster. It's it's just down the road from the animal dealer. So you go to the same way as the animal dealer, and then it's just the next next place off on your right. Oh, nice. So follow this road all the way down until you hit the kind of the highway road. You'll take a right yeah. and you'll cross the water. The first one's the animal dealer where you could sell the hay bales and then you'll go back onto the main road and then the next it's not it's not the road that goes through there but then there's a next set of buildings. It's in the next set of buildings. I think like something's blinking on my map. I might have tagged it. I'm not sure. Okay. Maybe. We'll find out. But if you say like keep going straight, I think the same place is blinking on my map. So, and the animal dealer, I can sell the stuff to the animal dealer as well, right? Yeah, you can sell the like hay the... bales or grass bales there. I wish we kind of remembered what the price was so we could compare. But yeah. oh no, you lost a tree. Your... Did I? Yeah, it's just sitting in the middle of the road for someone to hit. <laughs> oh no! Thanks. Don't call the uh... police on me, though. You're guilty now. How did I lose it? Maybe it wasn't firmly placed in there. Yeah, I don't know that either. You must... Oh, you lost two trees. Oh, no. And again? Nothing like fallen... Nothing like fallen out of my... Not visually. Maybe it's just my game or something, I don't know. Miller's Sawmill. Okay. Hello, Mr. Miller, I have some trees for you. Would you please reimburse me for my troubles of cutting these? I'm interested to see how much these go for. Oh, I need to tip him into like the designated area. Okay. Oh, really? This is a tipper trailer, right? Yep. Uh, how do I tip it? There, there, almost. How do I tip it? I think it was like LB and B or something like that. Try it because I can't sure. understand. Yeah, there's no option. Huh. Oh, sell wood? That was easy. 
Oh, there you go. 200. Uh, so th can you see this exclamation mark outside the trailer? Oh, so what? There you go. Yeah. Yeah. So you just have to sort of park it in there. Okay, that was easy. 200. Well, that was not worth it. It was not the prime wood. Yeah, uh, it was not. The animal dealer on the way back. Yep, just uh, the the next left, basically. Not on the road, but the. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah, shortcut. Oh my god, this is a little bit treacherous. This is quite the hill, isn't it? So right. Alright, these things. Boom, 460 worth. That's a good amount, and, and that was just all the random grass laying around our place, so. Also, oh, on the Moxie map, not the mini map, but the Moxie map, <laughs> you can see the attachments in the store, like they're spawned already, like they're orange dots. Oh yeah, yeah, I can see that. Are you driving with the mini map or the maxi map? Maxi map. Maxi map. Yeah, I think these have the same top speed on the road, if I remember. 42, yeah, and yours is... This well, is 43, so I guess this is a little well, bit faster. But I'm towing a trailer. That is true. I think it was 42 without it, if I remember, though. I kind of like struggle to find traction in this game in terms of like being really productive or <laughs> like we're all, all over the place. So yeah, I agree. This, cut a bit of that. It's just so wide open, it's kind of hard to stay focused with one thing. Alright, hopefully these... Now we've invested so much money in these plants and uh, in these potatoes and these beets. Hopefully we can sort of narrow it down a little bit. Yeah. Well, quickly we didn't do animals as well, we would be definitely all over the place. Yeah, it would be really fun, but I think it might be quite a challenge. I think the crops are probably more forgiving. You can see a little tractor trying to overtake. Yeah, I'm slowly gaining on you. It's taken this whole time just to catch up. <laughs> You're in the slipstream. Uh, yeah, right. Shortcut. <laughs> he kept following me. Yeah. Oh, where did you go? Oh, you're going... Oh, no, you crashed into something. That's yeah, I funny. crashed. <laughs> I was looking at the map. I'm like, because I was just following you. I wasn't looking where I was going at all. I'm like, oh, it looks like we're here. Wait a minute, do we need like a forklift to load those uh, seeds on to bring them back? No, 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 no. Um, I think you just like attach the, the planter and it will give you an option to refill. Because you're like in the proximity of the pallet. Oops. Wait, which one of um, these two red things is a, is a planter, JJ? I, your tractor's a little bit small for this one. You got oh, infinite so wheelies shall, again. Shall we swap? Yeah, shall we swap? <laughs> You're gonna have to ride a wheelie all the way there. What about the... Can I, can I try the potato one? Yeah, you can grab the little red one, maybe. Definitely the one I do wheelies. Okay. Were you trying to grab oh, this big I, red one? Yeah, I just want to see if it wheelies or not. Sure. Yep. <laughs> That's wheelie. Really... Let me buy uh... some weights. Are the weights expensive? I don't think so. I don't remember though. Weights, weights, weights. Oh, wait. oh, here we go. Oh, not expensive at all. 650. Oh, that's it? Yeah, that could yeah. be helpful. Cheapest chips. Oh, 
was you able to refill the seats or not yet? Oh, that's uh, in a way. I didn't, uh... Look, I was able to grab this one from the front, too. So you might be able to oh. hook up to that small one on the back. What? I was able to grab both of them? Yeah, so I can take both the heavy ones, you can take the littler ones. But I don't think you can refill the seats now that you have other app. It says select seed, but how do I... Do I just push... And which one are you selecting the seed for? It, it has it on corn right now. But I don't know... It says you first need to fill the tool. Here, I'll let you hop in, see if you can... You probably know a little better how to do that. Probably not. Um, refill the seed there. Oh my god, you just started uh, taking it down. Did you oh. see the pallet? That's potatoes for me. Oh, okay. Well, I mean... So whatever works. So, see there... Potato see there. Oh, the maybe be, maybe because you pulled forward a little bit, the potato seeder's in the back. So maybe that's why. Oh, yes, yes, yes. You're right, yeah. There you go. Pallet's all gone. So, yeah, so the... the Ah, so with the, with the, um, gotcha, gotcha, with Y, you can, if you press uh, Y button, Y, without practice pressing anything, you select which one tool you want to activate, front or the back. You want to try that? I'll buy yeah, another pallet of goodies. Okay, so you said you can push, practice. push Y? Yes, oh, so. Oh, okay. It's hard I see to it. see, but like at the top, at the top, like, of your screen, top left, you'll see, you can toggle between that. Oh, the front and back, yeah, that's right. Yes. Select next tool. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Yeah, I got the so front now one now. Now sugar beets, so I bought a pallet for you. Just pawned it in. See if you can drive up to it with the front and refill it. Um, yep. Watch the pallet. Do I just push Y or how do I... Um, I think it's a left thumbstick you need to press in. So L, L, sorry, maybe press LB, hold LB, and then the thumbstick. I don't exactly remember. It should say what? on the commands, no? Does it say... Re so it says turn on, there, lower, says. fold, oh, refill. Okay. Maybe because it's on the front I can't do it? It's think? funny because... It's funny because you, when you press brake lights, the front of the of this tractor, <laughs> the brake lights come on. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, on this attachment. Maybe try and drop maybe maybe try and drop the the back of the back attachment and attach the blue one to the back. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna try that. Let's do that. Um, maybe you can only attach it from the back because it's meant to be towed, right? Oops. Okay, so back attachment, detach. Let's we'll see if this works now. Yeah, it doesn't have an option to fill it, probably because you're only supposed to grab it from the back. Maybe it's just supposed to be transported yeah. from the front. Yeah, so because it even has like brake lights on the back of it. <laughs> yeah. You're trying to break a game. Do you want to see if you can uh, pick that one up now? Just to see if with yeah. if your weight helps with it. And also, I love how we refilled it with potatoes and there's actually potatoes in there because there's no such thing as seeds for potatoes, right? You actually plant potatoes to grow more potatoes. I think so, yeah. There, there's not really a seed in the potato, so it's just, yeah. Yeah, no, we, I think like, I remember how my grandparents used to do it. You like cut potato in half and you, you put it in the dirt and it grows more potatoes out of it. Okay, yeah, so you're not I'm tipping with that one. Nice. Um, what is fold cedar? Okay, that folds it in. Lower, that's not it. That's very interesting though. Huh. So I have it on the seed that I'm supposed to be, but how do I fill it up? I don't understand. Um, I think it was either left. Oh, you said the left thumb stick in. Left, left thumb sticking, uh, left thumb stick in, or the yeah, yeah. Even now it comes up for me. I only drive up to it and it comes up 
Maybe you bought the wrong attachment. Yeah, on mine it just says fold cedar, lower cedar, and turn on, and then select seed, but it, it doesn't have any option to fill it. Oh, it, maybe it's, it looks like it's already full, actually. But what? <laughs> In the bottom corner, it says 100%. What? It's got 600 liters in it. Oh, so maybe you don't buy beetroot seeds? That comes with it. That wouldn't make any sense, though. I'm not sure, but it, it, it says it's full. Unless... What is the icon for potatoes? Can I hop in here and quick and see? Oh, it Whoa. is. It is full. You, you filled it with... Right. You fi no, you filled it with potatoes. It's the same icon. No, it's not. No, this one clearly has beetroot. Oh, really? Jump maybe in again. My, maybe my game is being weird. Mine is the exact same icon. But okay, whatever. That works, I guess. Yeah, yeah that you have a beetroot, right? No, on mine it's just a potato that, still. No, that's it's not a potato. That's how the beetroot looks like. So we put beetroot... But yeah, you're right. On both of them it says the same. You're right. Oh, you're right. okay. I was gonna say, so we put the, the but same. Uh, never mind. I, th I thought we accidentally put the same one in both because it. Oops. How do you toggle? How do you toggle different? Uh, different seed, JJ. Uh, LB and then push Y. Oh. Maybe it's just what whatever seed you have selected. I am so confused. I'm very it confused showed potato as well. Before I get like I almost swear by it, it showed potato before. I mean, it looks like so potatoes. Now... Uh, we'll see. Oh yeah, go ahead. Sorry. I know. I'm just. I mean, it looks like you took some from it. Yeah, so on your tractor, this is the... This is... We're toggling... We're toggling on the tractor. I'm just gonna drive a bit further. Yeah, this is you toggling on the tractor. Soybeans. Sugar beet. I'm just confused because we don't have any of that stuff. We have potatoes and no, but it's, sugar beets. Is it the same? I'm confused. And you can't toggle on this tractor. So it must be potatoes. This is only for potatoes, right? I believe it's only for potatoes. That's probably... You have like a general seeder then, maybe. I'm just gonna refill with this and... And whatever grows, whatever grows, I guess, right? <laughs> Can I hop in quick? I want to see what it, what it says. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so it just says 1,500 liters. Okay, that's interesting. But on your tractor, like on the blue cedar, you can actually get to select what you want to plant. Yeah, that's true. Confused.com, JJ. Let's go. Alright, let's go. We'll have to uh, come back for our, our other trailer, I think. Oh, I'm still doing really JJ, with the full seeds. Oh, really? I'm gonna buy more weights, I'm gonna sell this one, sorry. Um, right, let's sell it. Let's sell this weight. I'm gonna buy the heaviest weight we can get. Uh, 3,000. Yeah, 3.3 tons, sounds good. That's what was the weight you bought on the last one? I think it was 1.5. And this one's 3.3? 3.3 definitely should be. That's should yeah, that's be quite a bit heavier. Now, now I put 3.3 at the front and the back wheels come up. No way. <laughs> yes. I look like a clown. Oh my gosh. You see me? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't steer. That's hilarious. But hopefully, if I manage to touch this, it will be fine. Come on, so close. 
Yes, there you yeah, go. There you go. Perfect, Good. yeah. And now you're not tipping up at all, huh? It just looks ridiculous. That, that oh, trailer is like really big for uh, your truck. My top speed considerably dropped. Feel free to overtake me. But what are these fields? This looks beautiful. So serene. Really green, yeah. Or you said serene, didn't you? I don't know if that's the word. Maybe I just made up the word. It's not an actual word. You look like a proper farmer, like an actual farmer with your John Deere truck. I'm just driving this mock mockery of a thing. It just looks like okay, you have a makeshift, like whatever works on your truck, you're just taking it. <laughs> Hold it on, yeah. Alright, I'm going flat out now. Let's see if I can pass you. Oh, of course, I'm flat out up the hill. <laughs> Oncoming uh, traffic. Okay, so yeah, this one's definitely got a little more power. That's for sure. Did you almost wipe that sign out? I did. I was looking back at you and I looked up and there's a, a sign there. So I guess we'll... Uh, I guess we're doing Beatrice then. This is quite wide. Oh, okay. That was close. You managed. You're a professional. Whoop. Almost hit that as well. This fruit cannot be planted in September. What? JJ, yeah, we messed, yeah, we messed up. Well, wait. Oh, that's potatoes, though. Hopefully, um, I think potatoes weren't in season. I think you're right, actually, about that. I think the sugar beets were. Um. Hopefully. Come on, please tell me, Jason, that you can plant something. <laughs> I'm going crazy. Whoop. Oh my <laughs> god, my tractor! I just gave it a little bump. Oh, tractor. What's a ridge marker? It's the, it's the little marker, so you can kind of like tell exactly how far you have to go out. Yeah, um... Lower cedar... Um... I think... Yeah, we'll put out the, the left side. You having fun up there? Mm -hmm. So we got sugar beets. Oh no, it says I can't plant in September either. Oh, for <laughs> What? What month is it? How can how are we so bad at farming? It is September. It says it's September now. And in game. Yeah, but we had it. It's actually September in game. There's a mid September. I always forget where the places to go are in this. Ah so the game is saying you can't plant it in September. We yeah, you can try. March or April. <laughs> oh, it's supposed to be do it March. Grass. <laughs> oh my God. Grass. Oh no, we can do wheat and barley as well. It's such amateurs. Please run me over now. <laughs> Distract. <laughs> <laughs> Don't want to live. <laughs> oh yeah. So I guess we should oh, buy okay. more attachments for wheat and barley. <laughs> oh my gosh. What did you say about it, million, JJ? Uh, it's dwindling fast. Yes. We got all kinds and of machines and attachments up. now. Yeah. yeah. Well, I guess these can wait till September then. I'm gonna put these on a the back burner. Oh, my God, JJ, we're so bad at this game. It's kind of funny we got this inside side all chopped up. I actually deserve to lose 50 subs for this. <laughs> I'm so bad at this.
I mean... I don't know if I want to laugh or cry at this point. Well, no, it says planting season. We got barley and wheat, grass and oilseed radish. So yeah, potatoes and whatever we grabbed, that that was bad. So we we could do wheat again or barley. I think we should try, or canola. Should we try canola? Um, one second, JJ. There's only four thing, five things that we can do. I mean, canola is going coming to the end of the season. To the season, we want to risk it with a bit for that biscuit. Yeah, why not? It's uh, three o'clock. We have all night. Okay, so let's I go think for we, it. We can run to the store quick and buy a few more things. And looking at this, in a few months we can use the both of these. They're actually up in January and February. So we can plant these what's, and then... Go ahead. What's canola, JJ? What's canola? I don't actually know, but like I said last time, I know they have like canola oil, which is kind of like a different oil you can cook with, like olive oil, kind of. So oh, I don't know so what I'm the... just looking at the icon, it's like a... Yeah, just memorize the icon and... We'll see what we can do with this. So grain. Oh, it's it's a, it's a it's a type of grain, basically canola. Okay. So yeah, it must be something kind of like uh, maybe like soybeans or something where you can kind of use the the beans to like soybean oil or whatever you know something like that to cook it. Yeah. So shall we do? Shall we do one for barley, one for canola? What was the first one you said? Barley. Barley? barley. Yeah, yeah, that sounds good. Let's try both of them. Let's buy two seeders then. All right. Because I'm now, I'm, I'm mad now. I want to make money. Yeah, we've already spent I'm so mad much money. A, I'm mad in like in a in a funny way, but I'm mad. But. It's not all bad, because now if we get contracts, we already have equipment that we can use, and we can kind of learn how to do it on the job. Cool. Like, it, it's kind of, it kind of sucks, but at the same time, like, we're going to make use of it. No, no, it's not, I'm not mad, I'm just, like, playing around the... Yeah, just a little bit it's frustrated. Funny. Yeah. Oh, did you already buy it? Oh, no, this is our trailer that's sitting here, that's right. I can't believe we just did that. Bought the wrong stuff. I bought the wrong Oh, I bought the wrong stuff. No, we. We bought the wrong stuff. Oh. I thought you were playing the blame game. <laughs> no, I said we. I can't believe we brought the wrong stuff. I tried to attach that trailer in the front of my truck just to see if it would work, and it does not for mine. Alright, let's check so barley is in season canola is in season okay i'm gonna do barley because we already done wheat i'm gonna do barley okay uh, you're doing barley okay. and i'll do what was the other one i already forgot canola canola i'm gonna actually lease so if you can buy the cedar i'm just gonna lease the cedar because okay this is gonna be quicker right yeah and we've already spent a lot of money yeah, so let's just buy one cedar. Let's not go crazy. So well, actually, mine, and if you can actually, buy your your cedar, remember it 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 could use multiple things. I don't remember what the other ones were, but there was sunflowers. That's in corn, I think. Oh, now I can select the seed. So yeah, I want to refill. Uh, what's how does barley look like? Who knows? Let's have a look. Barley looks like a wheat, just with like. Yeah, some lines coming off the top, kind of. Some fast, fast, fast weed. <laughs> fast weed, yeah. Yeah, okay. Um, Canola looks like a flower. Yeah. Here we go. I am full. I'm going back, JJ. Okay, Canola I don't I don't see anything on the packs for Canola, so I have no idea what I'm supposed to be buying for that. Oh, and also, just, just, just a general... Um, what do you mean, the attachment? The cedar? Yeah, I don't know what we need for it. 
at all. Yeah, so press the left menu button, you know, the select or whatever the button, and go into yeah. the box again. Yeah. Like the box icon, and then go into grain. And if you go into the seeder, it will show you that. And the seeder will show you at the bottom what, what uh, stuff okay. you can plant. Okay, so this, we are, does our, does either of our, um, cedars work for canola, do you know? Um, the ones that we have now, you need to buy a new one. Well, it looks like, like the one that you one. have, the one that you have right now might work. Yeah, Which it does, is... it does work, yeah. It does all the, all the grains. Okay, so we don't need anything else for it then, do you think? Uh, I think we should buy one, because this is least. I'm just gonna sort of help out for the quicker progress, if that makes sense. And I'm gonna okay. return it, So, but you should buy one for our farm, that's for sure. Okay, so buy kind of the same cedar, probably. Mm -hmm. There's just so much stuff on here. <laughs> it's like millions. Of options. Oh, what was that noise? My right. guy I... doesn't look healthy. This one, the one that you got, I think is 35,000. Yeah, that's the one. Okay. You got it. And don't forget the pallet. Oh, I need to buy a pallet too? Yeah, that one's almost empty. It has like two bags left in it. Okay. It might be enough though. I don't know if you want to risk it, but we're going to need the pallet anyway for the next. You know, they're not going to disappear. We can use them for any grain anyway. Okay, let's try this. Are oh, you gonna try and refill it from the front? Yeah, I'm gonna try. We'll see if it works. Oh yeah, refill. Okay, that works. Nice. And um, we want Nola. canola for this one, right? Yeah. Okay. It's kind of cool watching those bags just go down. Also, I'd use that one first and then start with the other one. Nice. Yeah, I just started clicking it and it just uh, uh, did it automatically, so... Oops. All right, we're ready to go. We are ready, JJ. Planting season commences. I'm gonna follow your lead. Oh, All we right. have the harvester attachment, remember? So that's good. Oh, the, gonna come in yeah, handy. The, the header. The header, because the, the, that's for the grain. So we, we mostly doing both. Both fields are gonna be grain. So nice. Yeah, that works. Look how much farming field there is in this like map, and we're only like using a smidge of it. Right, and we've barely even drove anywhere. Like we've only gone back and forth right. to the same spots, kind of. We are average gamers. Yeah, we should be able to plant all this, I think, before the next uh, couple of hours in-game are done. Mm. Like, your tractor is a giga, giga tractor. You can actually, like, do everything, attach everything to it. Mind, <laughs> mind you attach a little trailer and you, you need to, like, counterbalance it or something. Yeah, it's probably a good idea to upgrade one of our tractors. 
best money that we spent. Beautiful parking, JJ. Well, thank you. I figured it's kind of out of the way back over there. We got all these attachments over here, so. Um, okay. I can... uh, I'm gonna start with the bigger field. Sure. Or you want the bigger field? It doesn't matter. I'll take either one. I'll do the bigger one. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna be professional about this. I'm gonna do the marker and everything. Unfold the seed there. Um, lower seed there. No such thing. Bridge marker. Yes, wanted. Open cover. Okay, wish me luck. Alright, good luck. I'm kind of curious if this will work on the front of my machine, so I'm going to test that out. Because, I mean, it attaches, so I don't know if it'll work on the front. I want to find out. My machine doesn't... Well, it looks like it would. It's got all the controls. Okay. Unfold the cedar. Yeah. Lower it. Lower it? I don't have an option to lower the cedar. Should oh, I really? Worried? I think so. Is it possible your tractor is like not powerful enough or something? The cedar yes. would be, you would think is would work because it's, it's not like digging into the ground very much or anything. I think it's entirely possible that my cedar is too heavy. <laughs> um, so you know when you press LB, JJ, yep. which button, which um, button lowers the cedar? Uh, B, LB, LB and B. Okay, so LB and B is my... Ah, okay, because I'm selecting the front of the C there. Uh, I'm selecting the front attachment, that's why it doesn't let me to lower oh, it. You know, I, yep. I was activating yeah. my weight instead of anything else. Okay, gotcha. now we're good. Okay. Unfold the C there. Do the rich thing. Lower the C there. And... Turn it on. There we go. Now we're doing it. Does yours look like anything's happening? It does. Look it like does? I'm planting like little rows of stuff. Maybe I do need to attach mine to the back because I have it on, but it doesn't look like anything's happening. Yeah, because the thing you're running is backwards, right? It needs to. It's like one directional. You can't. The, the front, you know, the little ro rollers sort of open the grooves and then the planters drop the seeds in. So if you're, like, if you're running it backwards, it's basically the whole thing is reversed. Does that make yeah, sense? Yeah, I just wanted to see if it would work. 
for science. Yeah, so exactly. Speak. Actually, how do you look at the map again? Um, to see if it, like, when the field changes color? Oh my god, that was like some sort of filter, if I remember correctly. Oh, it looks like it, it worked in certain little patches. Oh, really? And it looks like yours isn't working at all. Also... Oh, wait. No, yours, yours should be working, but it's not showing anything on Barley. Also, why is my, like, wheel spinning for my tractor? Should I be worried? I was watching that, yeah. It, it looks like it's it's struggling a little bit. So, a little bit. A little bit. A little bit, yeah. Whoa. There we go. I'm definitely planting, I can't guarantee it, JJ. Is your is your numbers going down in the bottom right corner? Yes. Oh okay. On the screen I was looking at, uh it wasn't doing anything. Like it wasn't showing that you had planted anything in that field. Alright, I'm gonna try this for science. Oh, this is working. No way. <laughs> oh, cause you, yeah, cause you cause you reverse in it, cause you reverse a little bit, and then it plants. Yeah. I think that's yeah. why. Yeah, that worked. It it planted a whole line. So yeah, if you drive in reverse, it works like that. <laughs> you know, New I challenge. Just had, yeah, I had Plant to try the whole field in reverse. I had to try for science, you know. Such a scientist. Such a farm scientist, JJ. The marker works really well. You can see where you need to go for the next run. Right, yeah. It's really helpful. It puts a nice straight line in the field for you. Yeah, and then you just follow it with your tractor. I'm definitely planting. I'm thinking, what's these odd lines on my field? And that's like electric, elect, uh, electricity hole in the wires they're casting a shadow oh yeah hmm. this is a fairly slow process by the way I might not be with your powerful tractor, but my my little thing is struggling. A lot of wheel spin happening. I seen that, yeah. You know, it's it's pretty quick on mine. It's got a max top speed of about 12 kilometers an hour. And I don't know if I just like looked at it and I ignored. It. And I ignore, ignored it for the majority of the time, but now the battery is going down like crazy. Oh, really? I bet that makes mm -hmm. sense, though. It's really struggling, so it's having to use way more power than before. Yeah. So maybe that's why people Realism. had commented that, yeah, that, that truck isn't that great, because once you start getting the bigger stuff, yeah, it really dra drains the uh, battery. That well, could be why. And there's a slight incline towards uh, towards the back <laughs> of the field, so yeah. Yeah, the struggle looks like, is real yeah it looks like you're really struggling over there. We do have that other tractor on sale. Remember, it's 45% off or whatever. Tempting, isn't it? It is. What do you think, JJ? I don't know, it might be worth it. I mean, we spent a lot of money, but once we have the equipment, um, we could just keep using it, you know? Or maybe you okay. can keep your eye out for the next couple episodes and see if there's a truck that you like. Some kind of tractor that pops up there. Because maybe that one's crazy. not, maybe that one's not the one that you want. Oh, uh, you bought it, late. huh? <laughs> too late. I can't, I can't be doing this, JJ. This is just a struggle. Yeah, it looks like a struggle. You've gotten like three swipes through the field, I think. 
okay, and I've so done all kinds thing. of science stuff over here. Okay. And you're still way, way sort of uh, more progressed than me. Or at least I think so the weight, that's for sure. Remember, you can tap tab and you can just uh, switch that tractor and drive it back. Pro tips by JJ. Oh, that's interesting. That's really nice uh, perspective. So I bought this tractor, this tractor and a second hand tractor because half of the maintenance bar is depleted. Oh, interesting. There's a maintenance building right by there. Uh, I At mean, it's half depleted, so mm, I don't think there's any immediate concern, but maybe soon. Yeah. That's interesting. I, I mean, I knew it was used, but I didn't know you'd have to fix it. That's kind of... I mean, most of the time you think when you buy used stuff, people like try and make it as nice as you can before you sell it, you know? So I just... Right, a little bit weird. It. Yeah. Try and get the most amount of money out of it. We'll be both John Deere in it now. Oh yeah, yeah. Thanks for uh, thanks for treating me for the new tractor, JJ. I I accidentally we, hired an AI worker again. I don't know whether we should like consciously try and not drive over the the seated bit because that ruins it again or not? Or am I now overthinking it? Um. Let me see. Because I had the map up. No, it looks like oh, it's fine. This is, this is like different, JJ. Different oh, you're experience. already back? Yes. <laughs> that was really fast. Well, that tractor looks nice. It's called... Uh... <laughs> Sorry, I had to sneeze there. It's called Not Hanging About. Not when you do things quickly in Europe, they say you're not hanging about. Okay, you're not hanging about. You're you're getting stuff done, putting in yeah. the work. Oh, this is pleasurable now. I like it. I just realized the last couple of times that I drove through my field, I didn't have the the thing turned on. The cedar. Also, word of advice: careful, because my seed has defaulted to grass, so I have to change it. If you disconnect the maybe the trailer or buy a new tractor, it defaults. Oh, interesting. This tractor is powerful. How are you getting on, JJ? I'm doing pretty good. I think... I'm not sure if this is true, but when I open up the map, it seemed like the, uh, the cedar comes up for some reason. It might be a weird little... I don't know if maybe I'm wrong on that, but... It seems like that was uh, the case. But I'm almost done. I, I did a couple of turns and I didn't have the cedar on or down. Probably because I checked the map earlier. So yeah, this is the best of us. I had to make a few more swipes back through. This is exciting to have some of our own crops down now. Yeah. <clears throat> Hopefully next episode we can start seeing it grow maybe even. Maybe, yeah. Uh, I think we'll have to accept some contracts in the next one and then start doing some random work to... Because we can't do anything to... Well. Yeah, we can't really do anything to our fields now. We just kind of got to let them grow, I think. 
We might have to do some stuff, like killing the weeds or something, but I think for the most part we are sort of done with our own fields for a while. These crops better <coughs> bring us tens of thousands of profit. The better, or else. The better. Oh, wow. Oh, wait, never mind. What happened? Um, our, I have a John Deere 8RX 370. You have a John Deere 8R280. Oh, so is that like the power number at the end? I'm assuming, but mine's an 8RX, yours is an 8R, so yours must be like a, a earlier version of mine. Yeah. All right, let's see. Turn on the cedar and lower the cedar. Oh, you doing a um, different seed? Oh, shoot. You're right, I am. <laughs> Whoops. Don't, don't forget to change it to uh, uh, barley, the fast, fast wheat, fast looking wheat. I think you need to turn the cedar off to change it. Barley, there we go. Barley. Okay, let's see. Turn it on. And yeah, we should be good. This looks nice. Yeah. It's beautiful. Quite satisfying, right? It is, especially when you got two of them going, like, it just looks nice. I'll let you grab the crazy bit. The crazy bit. Okay, so we gotta return your cedar. Yep. And we gotta return the uh, the baler. We had rented that yes. in the last one. Um, we should I definitely return the baler. I don't know why we haven't, or why I haven't. Probably well, we still got. We still got like. Uh, actually, we could leave it here. We still got. It's four and a half, five, five hours, I guess. We could possibly use it. I mean, it's quite a while. It's probably like an hour, hour and a half, maybe something like that at game time, don't you think? Yeah, looks like. Maybe it's less than that, but it, it's a decent amount of time still. Yeah, the front of the tractors looks almost identical. Yeah, they do. It's nice we both have the front attachments now. It looks really nice. That's a screenshot moment. Hmm. Oh, beautiful. <coughs> okay. Um, yours is, so what yours is looks this? slightly higher because your tires from the back. All right, yes. Oh my gosh, look at these big old rocks you got in here. It's fertilizer, natural fertilizer. Right. All right, so well, should we call it a video here? Just... Uh, yeah, absolutely, I think. Why does it say... Why does it say the... Oh, it says it needs rolling. That's the thing where you push the rocks into the ground. That's what it was. Ah, uh, gotcha. Let's see, does this say the same? Probably, because we did the same thing over here. Needs rolling, yeah. Okay. So maybe in the next video we'll have to get a roller, and then I think after that we're probably done with our fields. Yep. Sounds like a plan.
Thank you guys for watching. If you want to watch another video, there's a random video on screen and another playlist. Please be sure to share the video, like it, comment, and subscribe. Turn on those bell notifications so you're notified when I upload. And until next time, peace.